The kit plug reached out to me to sponsor this video, so I'm going to be using their kits exclusively for this cookup. I'll leave a link to their website in the description section of this video in case you want to grab any of these kits for yourself. Machine Gun Kelly, aka Richard Colson Baker, is an American rapper, singer, and actor from Cleveland, Ohio. MGK cites his three biggest rap influences as being Eminem, DMX, and Ludacris. The first rap song that really sparked his interest in the genre was DMX's We Right Here from the Great Depression album released in 2001. MGK's early childhood was seldom stable as he moved around quite a bit, taking up residence in Egypt, Germany, Chicago, Denver, and Cleveland. In high school, at the age of 16, MGK released his first demo tape entitled Stamp of Approval, and he began performing at local venues in Cleveland. MGK started getting real exposure when he was featured on MTV2's Sucker Free Freestyle, and shortly thereafter, he released his second mixtape entitled 100 Words and Running. In 2011, MGK was approached by P. Diddy in Austin, Texas, while performing in his first South by Southwest show. Diddy offered MGK a recording contract with Bad Boy Records, and he's been signed with them ever since. Let's get into the cookup. First off, I pulled up this preset in Omnisphere from the kit plug status bank, and I laid down a simple chord progression in A minor, alternating between the five and one chord. Here's what it sounds like. Next, I opened up this bell preset from the Skyfall bank, and I layered it with these keys from the status bank. I also applied some effects to them. First off, I used an EQ to cut the highs around 4 kHz, and I cut the lows around 578 Hz. I also applied this gross beat preset with automation so that it's only active at the end of each loop. Here's what it sounds like. I pulled up this bell from the Skyfall bank, and I laid down these keys. I'm going to have two different sections of the beat. One section is going to feature a sub bass, and the other section is going to feature an 808. For my sub bass, I'll be using this preset in Omnisphere from the status bank. Also in the sub bass section, I'll be using this guitar preset from the Skyfall Bank. Here's what it sounds like with no effects added. I added some effects to the guitar so it would sit better in the mix. First I added an EQ to cut the lows at 272 Hz, and another EQ to boost the highs around 5.5 kHz. I also threw quite a bit of reverb on there as well. Here's what the guitar patch sounds like with effects added. The sub bass section is also going to have its own set of drums. For this project, I'll be using drums exclusively from the Kit Plugs DX RK kit. I laid down this hat pattern. I wanted the vibe to be a bit darker and more spacey. To accomplish this, I had to add some effects. First, I added an EQ to cut the highs around 1.8 kHz, and I cut the lows around 600 Hz. This will eliminate some of the brightness from the hats. I also added a bit of reverb to give a sense of space to the hats. Here's what they sound like with effects added. I'm also using this snare in the sub bass section. It also needs some effects added to it to give it a darker, spacier sound. I added an EQ to cut the highs around 1.6 kHz, and I cut the lows around 400 Hz. I added a 1 8 delay for an echo effect, and I also added some reverb. Here's what the snare sounds like with effects added. I added this vocal chop from the Kit Plugs Voices kit. Then I added some effects to it. 
I used an EQ to boost the high mids around 1.1 kilohertz and cut the lows around 300 hertz. I also added this crusher to give the sample a more gritty feel. This is a free plugin, and if I remember, I'll leave a download link in the description section of this video. I added a low pass around 6.3 kilohertz. I added a one quarter delay. And lastly, I added an imager to widen up the stereo image a little bit. Here's what the vocal chop sounds like with effects added. I layered this snare with this clap. I laid down an open hat. I laid down this perk. I decided to add some effects to this perk as well. First I added an EQ to cut the highs around 3 kHz, and I cut the lows at 1 kHz. I added a little reverb as well. Here's what the perk sounds like with effects added. I laid down this hat pattern. I made this kick pattern. I laid down this 808. I decided to add some effects to the 808. First, I added a little bit of distortion. Then I added an EQ to boost around 60 hertz and 250 hertz. Here's what the 808 sounds like with effects added. And lastly, I laid down this perk. All right, now it's time to write some lyrics. MGK's lyrics tend to focus on, one, references to how he came from nothing. Two, I've heard a few songs where he talks about how he used to eat ramen noodles when he was broke. Three, weed. Four, references to Cleveland. Five, references to himself as the gunner. As always, my vocal mixing is essentially the same as all my other videos. I'll leave a link to the vocal mixing tutorial in the description section of this video. And a disclaimer for anyone new to my channel. I'm not attempting to do an impression of MGK. I'm simply attempting to emulate his flow and subject matter. With all of that out of the way, let's see what we've come up with. 